everyone! Today we're going to explore the basics of window functions in Postgres. A window function is a function that performs a calculation across a set of rows that are somehow related to the current row. To see this in action, let's consider our keyboards table. By reading from the table, we can see that we have a number of keyboards organized into brands. If we wanted to compare each keyboard's price to the average price for their brand, we could do this with a window function. A window function starts with the function we're wanting to execute, which in our case is AVG so we can find the average price, and is followed by an over clause. The over clause in a window function allows us to use a partition by clause to specify how the rows are to be split up or divided into partitions for the calculation. To break rows apart by brand, we would provide the partition by clause with our column name, brand. If we provide no arguments to the over clause, the calculation will be executed within a single partition containing all of the rows in the table. Window functions also support an order by clause. The order by clause in a window function changes the behavior of what's called the window frame. When an order by clause is not present, the default window frame consists of all rows in the current partition. Once an order by clause is added, the window frame changes to consist of all rows from the start of the partition up to the current row, plus any rows that are equal to the current row according to the specified order. An easy way to see this framing behavior is to use the sum function and order by price in our window function. Looking at the first three rows of results, we can see that the second and third rows have the same sum, and that sum is for the first three rows. This is because these two rows share the same price, so the rows fall into the same window frame and were added to the sum at the same time. We can see the same behavior anywhere the keyboards had matching prices. It's also possible to use the order by clause in conjunction with the partition by clause. The only thing we have to do is make sure that the partition by clause always precedes the order by. Window functions are executed against the virtual table produced by a queries from clause and its filtering clauses, where, having, and group by. This means that window functions can't be part of any of the logic in those clauses. They are only permitted in the select list and the order by clause. We can see this in action with a quick example. We'll start by using a window function to determine the ranking for each product's price according to brand. We'll call this value brand rank. We can see from the output that the returned rows are ordered by brand, then by their brand ranking. We could order by brand ranking only by passing our brand rank alias to the order by clause at the end of the query. However, if we try to use the brand rank as part of a where clause, Postgres throws an error, saying that the column doesn't exist. Because window functions execute after WHERE clauses, our window function alias was not yet defined when we tried to use it in our last query. If we wanted to rank our products by price within their brand and only return the three least expensive products per brand, we could use a window function within a subselect. We can see from our output that our last query worked. This is because the subselect was executed first, allowing us to use the results of the window function in our where clause. Thanks for watching.